Look at the sunrise this morning. How incredible is that? Let's see if I can't get it to. It's so pretty. So, yeah. This, this whole the sun's not awake yeah. at seven is kind of brutal. So I woke up feeling like a little nasty, congested, and I'm like, crap. This could be the first cold I've had in like a year. <laughs> um, I'm hoping it's allergies from camping and like just being back here is. Oh, we'll set it straight. I don't know. I'm in denial. I'm like, I can't be sick. I can't be sick. Uh, so anyhow, though, I went to bed at eight last night and I woke up on my own at six. So clearly I needed the sleep because I slept for a really long time. More laundry, just taking the recycling out, but um, doing more laundry. We have that uh, the neighbor girl over this morning, so I'll take her to school this morning. They're eating breakfast right now, scrambled eggs and toast. Um, oh, this has got to go away. It has to. I have so much work from being gone all weekend. I'm like, I can't feel under the weather. I just can't. It has to be allergies. I have to feel better. Just, I'm going to go to the gym. I'm going to live life like normal. I ate so many ruffles this weekend that, and the dip, that whole jar of dip I ate by myself. I'm stingy I wouldn't share um, so I uh, yeah and I'm also still unpacking a little bit so good time oh, I got the car seats all washed yesterday so they're all like nice and clean again well sort of ish there's okay German short hair hair weaves and it's so annoying so you have to pick each piece out but it's fine um, so I'm putting the car back together. You guys, I seriously left my car keys on my car yesterday. <laughs> so if anybody wanted to steal my car, last night was the night. The keys were on the hood. Made that very convenient for everybody. Jeez. Are you tamping, Deacon? <laughs> Thanks. Do you know how to make my whole cup? If I could teach you how to make my latte every morning, we could really work on our relationship here. You could become my favorite. Now what do I do? Put it back in? <laughs> All right, guys, this is the con of letting the kids dig a hole. You see this? This is like every single day. So Deacon's gotten really good with a broom and has been sweeping all of this up. Of course, now, you know, I just took him to school, so he's not home to do it, but, oh, my goodness. All right, so I just got to the gym, and I am going to hopefully have a good, decent-ish workout, even if it's kind of just a lazy one. I need to do something. All right. Moving. So my friend and I went to Costco together and now we're divvying up corn and tomatoes and beans. <laughs> like, saving money. All right, so I just had a pretty large Costco haul, Costco trip. So I will record that now and upload that separately. But yeah, so I just got home and I'm gonna put all this All right, away. I just recorded the haul. I did not shower at the gym today. So I went to Costco again like this with this gray or with this red sweatshirt with these awesome not matching leggings it's like a fashion statement and i look at me i look a hot mess my face is all dry and well anyways um i'm gonna buy groceries now i love this part i love it i feel like it just destroys my kitchen and i can't even function um i'm gonna upload a video i need to edit from camping i haven't done that yet so i need to get those put up Oh, I feel like I have so much to do and I just don't want to do much. I am currently working on cleaning. My goodness gracious. I have so much laundry. It is ridiculous. Um, I, well, I'm not just working on cleaning. I've been working for the last three, four hours. <sighs> so, guys, I'm exhausted. Oh, I did take a shower. So that's why I'm changed. But I didn't wash my hair or anything because I did that last night. And we did not work out very hard today at the gym. We walked leisurely on the treadmill for about 20 minutes, and then we did lap pull downs. That was it. Oh, we did a couple, not even like a full set of chest presses. So it was a pretty intense day at the gym, as in not at all. We just were like, let's just go to Costco. We're done with this. So we didn't even shower. We didn't bring a sweat. It was less walking than when I chased Gage for our morning walk, so, and which I haven't even done today. Ugh. I'm kind of just in a blah mood and our house is such a disaster from this weekend. I mean, I have, I'll show you the laundry and the kids got so much crap. It's just crap from trick or treating the other night. Granted, there were only six kids out there and then there was a baby and like a six week old, a one year old and a six week old. And 
they were there. So there were eight kids total, but it was mostly adults and even adults that don't have kids or like grandparents. And everybody created these like massive goodie bags that had like mini Jenga and a billion glow sticks and light up things and like a stuffed animal or a coloring book or color coloring crayons or uh, colored pencils or what else was there? Like tons of candy, ridiculous, like treat bags just full of candy from top to bottom because everybody bought these massive bags of candy instead of passing it out to, you know, 40 trick-or-treaters, they went to six kids. So they got a lot, like grocery bags full. So they scored better than trick-or-treating. So it's kind of nice because it lasts is like it lasts for like five minutes. You see six kids. They get way more. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> but now we have all this stuff and I'm just kind of like, meh. I don't know what to do with it all. So they got to figure out what to do with it. So I'll show you their pile too. They have to pack up from camping because, you know, they played. So they got to take care of their stuff. It's not just my job. <sighs> so anyhow, I just don't want to. I want to get it done, but physically my body's like, no, you're See, not. This is the laundry chair and it's back with a vengeance because we've got a couple of loads of laundry in here as well. So laundry chairs is back. Gage is tired. It was a long, I mean, it was a serious weekend. Caliber's tired. I mean, he looks like a puppy. I mean, here's some of the crap. See what I mean? A jump rope. They got a jump rope. They got cool pencils. They got candy. I mean, there's candy wrappers. A light up squishy mummy. Here's more. A glow axe. What is in this bag? Oh, it looks like just gummy bears. And this one. Oh, silly string. So every camp there was probably 15 different like camps within our campsite because there was easily 30 like 30 different adults let me let me show you hold on one second <laughs> they got stickers and bubbles and teeth and more glow stuff and more bags of candy i mean just like it was ridiculous i mean seriously look at this every single camp has handed out these massive bags <laughs> so the kids would go to like four different camps and have to empty out their buckets and then come back and do more. So like, I'm not exaggerating. It was absurd. So I think that was my, I think I gave out the smallest one. So anyhow, I mean, this is ridiculous. Oh, water bottles and sticker packs and just like probably the best trick or treating ever. Play-Doh. I mean, this is absurd. And I already picked out all of my favorites because <laughs> it's what moms do, you know? What are you doing to your cake right now? We decided to make a cake for dessert for this week. Oh my word. And Drake is adding some ingredients to his. So he's getting his own pan of cake because, ew. Here is Drake's finished cake. Drake, what all did you put in there? I forgot. Oh, it's going to be interesting, buddy. Is this a barley? Yes, that's a barley. Mm-hmm. Poor Drake just fell out of his chair, goofing off, because these chairs, you can really fall out of them. How's dinner? Do you like this dinner? This is that, sorry the lighting's so wonky, the sun's setting behind us. This is that vegetable barley soup from Costco. It's pretty goody, huh? It's pretty goody, it's pretty good. It is good. I'm almost done. Deacon's doing some sweeping because he says his is too hot, so... Whatever, but it's not, is it? It's good, isn't it? Yeah, we like this one quite a bit. Are you ready to eat? Yes. You want cake? You gotta eat all your soup. So the Christmas leggings came, which is really exciting because my Halloween leggings were really late, if you remember that whole fiasco. Ooh, I have peppermint on my neck and I just touched my neck and my hands are cold. It's like icy. Anyways, um, so yeah, I did, I did, I took the pictures. The kids are finishing dinner very slowly, and I am just shipping off a couple things while they eat. I kind of work on the dishes, and I was working on the dishes, and then I was shipping. Anyways, that's where I'm, I'm What are you doing? Eating a giant spoon of peanut butter. How come? Because I have the hiccups. Okay. You're not going to be able to breathe. And you've got, I think, still cake on your face. <laughs> oh, my God. You want some water? This oh. is so cute. Oh, it looks so wrong. Uh, it says, draw, what will you be? Draw a picture of your costume. Drake will be, I will be a FS. I love kid art so much. Again, 
It's nine o'clock now. The funniest, oh my gosh, Drake's page is so funny. Um, anyways, I just sat down on the couch with my laptop because I'm going to get working. And twice today, I couldn't find my peanut butter. <laughs> so remember the video the other day where I sat down on the couch at like one o'clock in the morning. I was telling you about how hungry I get when I stay up that late and things like that. Well, I was eating peanut butter that night with pretzel, like those pretzel crisps. They're on the other side of the couch. And I was dipping them directly into the peanut butter. Like, you know, just dipping it in and then eating it whole. I wasn't like double dipping or anything crazy. Um, but I couldn't find the peanut butter with Deacon's hiccups or when I was making peanut butter and jelly sandwiches this morning. So, yeah, now my kids are yelling. What? Okay. Um, making good progress, actually. And I think I'm going to edit or at least try to edit one or two of the videos from camping. Oh my gosh, you guys, my voice. No. Um, I'm still in denial. Complete denial. I feel fine. Actually, I still feel like it's my allergies. And it was just kind of a rough weekend, like I said, sleep-wise. So it's hard to say what's wrong with me. Um, but I can't get my voice to sound normal, and I know it. Anyways, got a lot uh, of work done. And tomorrow, uh, Drake has a field trip I'm chaperoning for Halloween. So I am going to um, get as much done as I can so that I can chaperone tomorrow without, you know, any of the worry of hurry up and hurrying up and getting home.